pigs go down, EXP comes up. Pigs go down, EXP comes up. Welcome back to the full stack server, guys. We're over here at the uh, gold farm, XP farm. <laughs> These stupid pigs just keep on coming. Like, oh, we're going to fall to our deaths and I ain't going to do anything. you think they would stop. I mean, you know, you'd see all their friends just going down a hole and never coming back. But, uh, nope, they don't. But anyhow, the reason I am over here getting some levels is I finally found some diamonds. And, uh... I kind of want to get some enchantments on some stuff. I need also. Ugh, I also need a silk touch pick because uh, the the else I want to build involves a lot of glass. So I want to be able to break it and not have or be able to remove it without breaking it. I guess is what I meant to say. Let's see, efficiency four. Come on, I'm breaking three. Oh, uh, efficiency four and a breaking thing. All right, so I guess we're gonna have to rely on the books. Lure three, seriously. All right, we're gonna enchant this shovel instead. I really don't. Fortune three on a shovel. Are you kidding me? All right, we'll go with lure three, I guess. And we go with sharpness two on it. We'll just go with the low one. <gasps> Unbreaking three, fortune two. Oh, that's not bad. We can put that one on one of the picks. Blast protection four, power two, power three. Uh, come on. Can we get silk touch? Fortune two. Sharpness three. Power four. Come on. Seriously, can we not get silk touch? Bane's Arthropod four. Amazing. Uh, that's the best enchantment ever. Oh, come on. We're down to two last ones. Silk Touch, Silk... Ooh, Infinity. That'll work, I guess. Uh, hmm. Efficiency 4. Darn it, we did not get a Silk Touch. So, uh, hmm. I guess I'm going to have to go dig up some more Lapis. And when I finally do get a Silk Touch pick, we're going to head over to Twin Pines and then we'll start building the house. Well, we're finally back. Uh, that took a lot longer and a lot harder to get the... I went back to go get some Lapis. And finally got some lapis, and then promptly was killed by a horde of zombies. I guess I should have taken torches with me and lit up the path behind me. But, yeah. Found a dark spot, and there was just a bunch of them. Killed me. Go back to get my stuff. And right there, sitting on top of my stuff, is a creeper. And I barely had an iron sword to fight it with. Luckily, I was able to hide it in a hole and kill it. And... Got rid of it, so I didn't lose any of my stuff, but I since have lost my helmet fighting all of them. But yeah, check out all these books we made. Yeah, look at that. We got Fini or Efficiency 4, 4, Efficiency 4, Alco Infinity 1, Power 4, Power 4, Power 4, Efficiency 3. And the guy I mean, just goes on and on. And we finally got this. I even made two more picks and didn't get very good enchantments on it. Well, I don't know where the fortune is. It's somewhere. It might be in my ender chest. But yeah. So we're going to pick this one. Uh, actually, do I have one that didn't have a breaking on it? Nope, don't have one. Alright. So we'll just put it on this pick right here then. Boop, boop. Wrong way. Actually. It's going to cost less to do it. Nope, it's going to cost the same. So we'll go ahead and put it on the fresh pick. Boom. There we go. Efficiency. See, four unbreaking three and silk touch one so now i can build this house with all this stuff right here and not worry about breaking the glass so i think we're gonna do a time lapse so here it is
All right. I hope you guys like that uh, little time lapse. So yeah, the house is uh, well, complete on the outside, not furnished on the inside. And I started building after I recorded that a little underground area, which is quite interesting to try to do since we're on top of an ocean, and I don't have any sponges to clean it out with. And instead of just asking for some sponges, which I'm pretty sure people would have let me borrow, I came up with an ingenious idea of using leaves. I just placed leaves all around here and then took them out and then took another layer down. And like, the, kind of like this. I mean, now it's like super easy because it doesn't take much to remove leaves. There you gotta go. I gotta fix this right here. It didn't quite turn out like I wanted it to. I was a little off in my placement. Oh, and I fell in the hole. I have a hole right there. But yeah. All I had to do is place a bunch of leaves in here and then come back through. And I got some dirt over here too because earlier I ran out of the leaves. Yeah, it's not perfect. I gotta redo it. This is basically where all my storage is gonna be. So, it doesn't have to be quite as nice up as upstairs. Which I will do something with the ceiling because you can see the dirt. Which I can't quite remove all the dirt. Because that's the little pathway into the house. So... Oh, misplaced. So yeah, this is all I've been doing is just placing the leaves and getting rid of dirt. Or I'm gonna find that hole again and fall in it. But so yeah, if you ever need to remove a, a small, I would say a small amount of water. Don't try to do a whole bunch with this this method. It'd be a hard uh, task to do. It'd be a lot easier to do with sponges. But I don't know anybody that has sponges at the moment. Which I'm sure there's some. Oops, that do have some because there is several ocean monuments that have been cleared out and they probably would have let me borrow them but I didn't want to bother anybody so I just did it this way which it works because this is the last little bit of it if I could place the leaves right it would be nice there we go but yeah I'm definitely gonna probably oh have to furnish the inside of the house a little bit better than it is I do have my bed inside now which is nice I don't have to worry about Sleeping and getting blown up because I've been blown up a couple of times lo logging in that I guess somebody Logged out and I guess I had a misplaced torch or two and left a dark spot. Oh, I placed it and now I got water flowing in here No, go back where you came from water Actually, just go away. You don't have to go back. Oh, I did it again. All right, let's just go ahead and pop these three. But yeah, now I have a nice little storage area that I'm gonna have to light up before. I'm sure if I don't light it up I will walk into something or walk into some mobs having a party down here and you know you bring a invite a creeper over and a skeleton over and a zombie over and then they bring out the tequila and then things get crazy it's all good until the tequila comes out but yeah so anyhow light this up real quick and then we'll climb our little happy butts back out of here because before i end this episode because i'm thinking i'm running pretty low on time because I want to keep these episodes about 10-15 minutes. That way they're kind of fast paced. Everybody's liking it. And nobody gets really bored. But. If you guys saw my tour episodes. There was a little word. Or little words. Little speech golf gave us. About. Uh, it's pranking people. And if you're going to do it. You might as well prank stress. So. My plans are to go over here. And I'm going to prank Stress real quick. Because she needs to be pranked. Why? Because she's Stress. So, I've come up with a little design for her head over here. That'll turn her into a monster. A zombie. So, she really will be a Stress monster. So, let's see if I can do this real quick. Place this like that. Bring those out. Hopefully nobody's watching me at the moment. Oh. oh yeah, look, you can just see her turn into a zombie already. Let's see, I put green there, green there, green there, green there. Place the red there. Go up for her hair like so. Run hair across here. I should have probably brought some ender pearls with me, and I didn't. So but basically I'm going to put a green block there green block there no, that, hmm, hmm, hmm. yeah maybe green block there 
That doesn't look right. I, did I bring? Oh, I did bring a pic. Sweet. I'm trying to go off this picture I have over on my other monitor. Oh, and I fell off. Ah, oh, horse poop. Oh, uh, here we'll just climb back up. I was trying to hope we get this done quickly. I don't want her to log on while I'm doing it. I'm pretty sure she's getting close to being logging on. She wanted to do stuff today. So I gotta hurry. Uh, here we go. Oh, look, it finally stopped raining. And we're gonna put some pink in here for brains. Like so. There we go. And then we'll just fill in the rest of her hair, which I don't. Looks like I'm gonna run out. I should have plenty. Hmm. Yeah, we can just fill in the rest with brown stained clay. And put two in there like that. And there we go. Alright, let's jump off here and check this out real quick. La 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 la. Ha ha! Uh, it's not quite. Oh, I missed a pink right there. There needs to be one more pink. Alright, let's climb up there real quick. We'll just fill her up with some clay. Um, is, that, is that where it needed to go? Yeah. There. I think that'll complete it. And then we'll run back over to her house and act like we never did anything. Yep. There we go. Stress monster. I hope you like it. <laughs> Alright. So, yep. There you go. I have fulfilled golf's wish by, if I'm going to prank, might as well be stress. So. And the sad part is, I really don't think she strip or pranks anybody. At least I haven't seen it. And that's what golf said. He's just like, yeah, I don't know if he does, she does or not, but we sure prank her. So now... I really feel at home on full stack. I have a house and twin pines and I have prank stress. Sorry, stress, but I think that's going to be it today. So I'll catch you guys later. Bye.